Hey, I'm Peter Pollock, and I'll be your guide for this easy animation tutorial. Please be aware that this tutorial is for Flash novices, so if you know your stuff, you don't need to be here. In order to get started with animation, there are some fundamental things that you need to know. First of all, you need to know about the toolbar. The toolbar is made up of a load of tools that you can use to draw or edit content on the Flash canvas. We won't cover all of the tools in this tutorial, but for the most part, they're quite easy to figure out. You also need to be familiar with the timeline, which is like a chronological representation of your animation. As the bar moves across the timeline, your Flash movie plays. In this tutorial, you're going to learn how to make an object move from one place to another. We'll start out by drawing something with the paintbrush tool. Obviously, whatever you draw doesn't matter, so feel free to draw unicorns if that's what you like. Next, on the timeline, right-click at about frame 20 and click Insert Keyframe. By doing so, you make your animation 20 frames long, which actually isn't much. After you click on frame 20, drag your drawing to anywhere else on the canvas. Now, if you test your movie by pressing both Control and Enter, you will see your drawing in one place for 19 frames and then in a different place for the last frame. We don't want your unicorn to teleport though, we just want it to move. Okay, so close your movie test and click back on the timeline. To make your drawing move, we are going to add what is called a motion tween. A motion tween basically moves an image from point A to point B automatically. So, right click between the first and last frame and click add motion tween. If done correctly, you should see an arrow going from the first frame to the last. When you test your movie, control and enter remember, you will hopefully be surprised to find that your drawing moves across the stage. Yeah, it's epic, but there's still some stuff that we can do to the animation. That stuff will be covered in the next tutorial. Thanks for watching.